Welcome back to Two Point Hospital. Today we're going to be starting on a new hospital. This one right here, Duckworth upon Bilge. Uh, I'm just going to click restart because I have loaded it into it before, so I don't know if it did anything, but we'll restart. Alrighty, Health Minister Tarquin Foxridge has requested our assistance. If we can meet the ministry's targets, we'll receive some of the county's healthcare budget, but we won't receive income for any diagnosis, treatment, or retail. Dang, so this is a public hospital. So basically we're not making any money from any of the treatments or diagnosis, but we need to meet the ministry's targets to earn money. Right. So, oh, here we go. New targets from Lord Foxbridge. We'll need to achieve this if we want extra funding to keep the hospital going. Train a staff member. I get 50 grand for doing that. All right, well, I mean, in that case, shouldn't I just, shouldn't I just like not treat anyone ever? <laughs> like, wouldn't that be the way to go? All right, well, we've got this little space. I've got 250 grand. I also have a few of these little thingies. So we've discovered some new illnesses. Uh, okay, but... Uh, so I guess this is just how this hospital starts because I, I didn't do any of this and we just restarted the levels. So I guess we start off with this, which is all right, no problems. Staff wise, we have two doctors, uh, two nurses, one assistant and no janitors. So probably should get a janitor. Now, I guess we need a training room, which I shall build. What is this? They've done an interesting layout in here, haven't they? You know what? I'm going to continue it. So I'm going to, oh, they've got windows right there. Uh, hmm. I'm going to do this. Wait, this has to be a, th this has to be three by three. Oh, that's annoying. All right. So I'm going to do this and that's it. Cause that is kind of weird. <laughs> That's fun. All right, so we're gonna do that. We'll get the little training thing here. We'll get our little chairs in. <laughs> I can only fit two with that door. Hang on, there we go. I can fit a bit more if I move them. Get another one here. I can fit four. I'm not gonna be training four people at a time, but just in case I was going, if I was going to, you know. Uh, can we remove those windows from here? I think I have to do it from the other room. Because I feel like there may be, well, no. Also, there probably just shouldn't be windows into a GP's office at all anyway. Like, couldn't someone just look in? I don't know, it seems a little, I'll get rid of those ones at least. I guess we'll keep that one for some reason. There you go. All right, so let's train. Let's train one of the doctors. I assume we can train one of the doctors, right? Yes. So these are both student doctors. Maybe I should just train them both in GP. What else do we have? The pharmacy, there's a ward. There is general diagnosis and cardiology, which I think it's all nurse stuff, right? So let's just get, let's get both doctors in there. Let's get, let's get both of them in there. Just for a little training session. We have currently have no doctors in this hospital. Uh, oh, I did not do like any heating or anything. Do we need heating here? I mean, it doesn't have any. It's It seems like it's cold in this place. So maybe we should have some. I don't actually know if we need it. You know what? I, I'll go around and add some. Oh, doctors required. It's going to be a while. <laughs> it's going to be a while before they're ready. Oh, hey, they have like a little phone. That's cool. Yeah, that person's cold. Sorry about that. Uh, I'm, I'm trying to heat it up. We only have radiator technology. We don't have any sort of like AC or anything. Whoa, this is a huge bathroom. I've never built them this big. <laughs> okay, there we go. It's a little warmer in here now. Someone just die? Oh yeah. Ah, well, these things happen. I probably should have just trained one staff member because it's probably going to ask me to train more after this, isn't it? What's the queue for the GP like? Four. Okay, okay. So does this room, that's a nurse. I think all the other rooms are nurses. So I probably should get another GP's office actually. I probably don't need one. Just make, whoops. Oh, here we go. Upgrade a machine. Oh, I can do that. Yeah, so I'm just gonna make another fun shaped GP's office. You know, it just looks like the others. Let me, uh, I'll slow down time a little bit. So what do we have in that way? A little rug, there's like a lamp and a filing cabinet. You know, I'm not gonna go too overboard with this, but you know, we'll make it nice at least. Actually, I can probably just move this, move, yeah, move this radiator into the room. Yeah, there you go. There you go. That's nice. There's a room into the, uh, room, a window into the pharmacy. It's beautiful. All right, let me get a little bench as well so I can sit here. All right, so wait, what do I have to do? Upgrade a machine. All right, let me upgrade. Is someone gonna use that? No, I think we're okay. I don't actually have someone that can upgrade or even fix anything at this point in time. So let's grab a janitor. You have mechanics and maintenance. So that allows you to upgrade. Well, this guy can do like ghost capture and has better stamina. He can kind of do everything. So you're kind of the guy. So we'll do that. That should hopefully be done soon. Oh, is that, is that done? Wait, what? Oh, maybe, did I click repair? <laughs> I was like, that is, <laughs> that was too quick. All right, so what are we, new illness, that's fine. All right, so far, Actually looks pretty good. We don't really have a queue or anything. Like we've got a couple of people waiting. Things are pretty calm. We need to cure five patients with eight bitten as well, uh, apparently. I don't even know what that is. So I'm gonna get my reputation up from 30% as well uh, and get to level eight in the hospital. Okay, yeah, look, we'll work towards that. We might need more nurses. Um, I do have a bit of money, so. Treatment, why don't we get a treatment nurse in cardio? Actually, is this diagnosis? Might be diagnosis. Oh, well, whatever. That nurse can move around, that's fine. So we do have a little bit of a queue for the pharmacy, but we're nearly done upgrading that machine. Then we should get another 50 grand. Yeah, sweet. So we got 50 grand for that. 
And at the same time, I might as well upgrade this one too. Because the better all these machines are, the, the, the you know, more likely we're going to um, cure everyone. All right, ward emergency. Cure six patients with jazz hand. I mean, I'll, I'll accept it. You know, we're a public hospital, so I should probably accept these things. But what I might do, let me get this, this person here. Hang on. So you are my nurse with ward management, Sophia Power. I'm just going to quickly purely assign you to the ward and I'll leave you on fracture ward as well. And then I'm going to say this is going to have two staff members. So hopefully, yeah, Sophia Power goes in there and then hopefully we can do that. I don't know if we will be able to, but we'll try. Yeah, yeah. So all those people are going to come in. They're coming from the helicopter. There they are. Oh, look, we actually cured someone. Sweet. And here come the alarm heads. Actually, can I um get some more benches here maybe? Because you guys are always going to be standing in a weird queue. Yeah. I actually also put that bench in a really awkward spot. Hang on, sorry guys, let me just, uh, there you go. You know what, we actually might be able to do this. We got two nurses in here. We only have five beds though, actually, I've just realized that is kind of a problem. Uh, if I go, not edit, how do you do this again? Customize, items, here we go. Yeah, so this way I don't actually have to pick up the room and plop it down again. I can just do this and add an extra bed. So then this person can go in now. I mean, it's a little awkward. You're all kind of like looking at each other, but especially this one in the middle. <laughs> Wait, the hospital's haunted? Oh boy, okay. <laughs> yeah, oh boy. All right, so upgrade a machine. Wait, we did upgrade a machine. How come they didn't? Oh, is it just a new one that we have to do again? Okay, fair enough. Hey, we upgraded a machine. Provide a 60,000 and one rep. Thanks for the one rep for that. Report a visit. Okay, cool, cool. All right, I mean, things are going pretty well. We got plenty of money. We don't, I think, have too bad of a queue. Uh, oh, what's this? Restock eight vending machines. Do we even, we have a couple of vending machines. All right, well. I'll just buy some more vending machines and then hopefully they're restocked. <laughs> oh, they have beanbag chairs in there. Sweet. Uh, kind of not really anywhere good to put these. I've got a snack machine there, salty snack machine here, and a drinks machine doesn't fit there. Get one here, I guess. All right, I got a few more of those. So those will be restocked over time. All right, special report. You cured three out of six. Actually, that's not too bad. Uh, shoot five mono beasts. Oh yeah, this is that thing where I think I, I totally forgot about this. But I think we had it last time and you kind of just see them. Uh, can't remember how you do it. Don't you like move stuff and sometimes they're like underneath it? I don't know. We might see a little thing hiding in dark places and under objects. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But I thought you would like me to train this nurse. All right. Well, um, I will train you in diagnosis. Sure. Let's do that. Where are the mono beasts at? Can upgrade my easy scan. Well, I don't really want to upgrade anything because what if it asked me to do it now, you know? Staff training. What? Just, just wait till the other person's trained, please. I also probably don't need two nurses in here anymore, so I'm going to get rid of... The extra. Yeah, can you... They haven't restocked any of them. <laughs> and there was just an announcement saying they need to be restocked. Oh, yes. There we go. We got one. Do we have any bins? Oh, yeah. We, there's one there. Okay. I saw a lot of people using the phone, actually. I don't even know there was a phone in here. Phone. Oh, I don't have it unlocked. That's why. Oh. Phonia. Well, telephone. Yes, I'll unlock it. Sure. Here you go, guys. Have a call of the loved ones. I get a few of those around. They seem to like it. So there's a lot of uh, training required, which I can't really do right now. You want a promotion. I don't really have money. I don't need a promotion. I, you know, I like myself being happy. I mean, I say I don't have money. We got 278,000, but I mean, like, we're not really making money besides these little tasks. I think I need more vending machines so that people use them more because we need to restock them. So... <laughs> <laughs> Maybe if I get more vending machines, we can restock more of them. There you go. Start promotion. All right, fine. Now, where are these mono beasts at? I haven't seen any. Oops, move this. Hello? No. I'm going to upgrade my easy scan to level three as well. It is 20 grand. I did say I didn't really want to until we need, like, until we got the thing, but I feel like we might as well. It will help us treat everyone and get them through the system quicker. Also, yeah, I don't know where these monobies are. I haven't seen any. You want a promotion as well? Man, this is a public hospital. We're not made of money here. Is there a way you can like invest in stocks and make money back? This janitor needs to like refill some more of these vending machines because they are not being restocked. I'm going to get this person with maintenance and stamina so they can help out too. Can I like force them to restock? I can sell. I can pick up. Call janitor. Oh, hang on. Yeah, just call janitor to restock. Whoa. Oh, that's the 8-bit one. Oh, yeah, that's the 8 bitten. I assume it is. That's awesome. That's so creepy. <laughs> All right, what's this? Abominable curse. A contagious disease has been detected in the hospital. The two-point center for disease control will reward us if they don't have to get involved. We've been issued a limited supply of vaccines. So, ooh, this is very topical. So it's up to us to vaccinate people displaying the telltale signs of the disease before it spreads. If we run out of vaccines or too many infected people escape, the... TPCDC will step in and handle the epidemic. Okay. Abominable curse is characterized by a peculiar walk reminiscent of patient suffering from premature mummification. The disease spreads through a powerful and ancient sneeze. Four infected people detected. 
20 vaccines available. Oh boy. So wait, how do I do that? Like, do I just click on someone? Oh, okay. So yeah, there's a vaccinate button. Okay. So, oh, well you, first of all, definitely look like you're the one that has it. So I'm going to vaccinate you and you. I feel like you shouldn't be able to do this while pause, but anyone else? Apparently four. We've seen two, at least two that look like they're walking like a mummy. That's my assumption. Hello? That person's got the eight bit disease. So there's that. Hmm. I mean, yeah, I'm pause here. Oh, you. Yeah. That is actually, okay, that's correct, because, oh, my big head's in the way, hang on. If I move it there, yeah, we can see infected, there's one left, uh, which is good to know. Where is this one? I think it might be them, because I'm not sure who else it would be. I'm trying to see people walking. Another 8-bit person. Are you? No, it's not you. <gasps> Where are they? Uh-oh, who has it? I don't see another person. I don't see another person. <laughs> Where are they? Like, outside the hospital? No, surely not. Oh, there. There you are, you cheeky little one. Hey! Contagious disease eradicated. That's all it takes. It's not that hard. Oh, I realized I left my head in the middle of the screen. My bad. Sorry. <laughs> That's all it takes. Uh, just you gotta pause time and find the people with the symptoms and just give them a vaccine. Not that difficult. <laughs> Sweet. Ward emergency. I mean, I can try that again. And I'm gonna get an extra nurse in there as well again. So extra patients arriving. So I don't think we've even um, diagnosed the eight bitten thing because we've got a few of those people around. Actually, I don't know where they've gone. Um, we had a few, I don't know if we just like sent them home or something or what, but those people with eight bitten seem to have disappeared. Uh, also actually it has a vending machine. Oh yeah, vending machines. And let me just call some janitors to restock these because so we need to do how many more? Like six? Oh, there they are. <laughs> yeah. How sweet is that? I don't, I don't know. I find that one really cool. Uh, let's do another two. That gets to four. Here we go. Oh, I can't even restock. No one's even been to these. I can't even restock them. Oh, there we go. Five, six, seven. Might just need to restock one of these again. Eight. Okay, that should be that should be all of them restocked. There we go. Five of eight. I just feel like we need to get a little bit of cash flowing right now. We have five of eight done, which is good. Oh, I think that this is my this is actually my new favorite. <laughs> I don't know why. I just really like it. Such a cool effect. That's awesome. It does remind me of the original like theme hospital. I mean, I don't think it was that pixelated, but <laughs> that jump. Cool. Uh, I wonder if I need a new assistant, like a second assistant. Psychiatry. Uh, I can get him to wait. Hang on. Uh, the assistant. Ninety days without a death. I mean, I think we're doing pretty okay without deaths at the moment, but might have spoken too soon there, so we'll see. All right, psychiatry. We could probably fit that in. Over here, there's a lot of space. I'm gonna have to move those vending machines. That's okay. Yeah, it needs to be like this at least, doesn't it? Three by three. All right, so we're gonna get this here. This, I'm just gonna put that there for now. And I'm gonna move these vending machines to here and I'll get one over here. Okay, uh, treatment bookcase. Let's get some of these in because that will give us what? 2% treatment power, which is good. I think this is also, I think psychiatry is also diagnosis. Hang on, let me, uh, I just need a, let's put this there and then this can go another treatment bookcase there. This gives us diagnosis and treatment power. The medicine, let's just get a bunch of medicine cabinets. There we go. Uh, we'll need a radiator for some heat. Um, there's a regular bookcase here. That's just reduces boredom. That's no good. Uh, we need, uh, well, we don't need, but I'm going to get a rug in here as well. It's always nice. And then we're going to get the drinks and food and somewhere to sit. I don't think they'll sit down here between patients. Yeah, so we'll get some snackies and some drinks. There we go. That'll do. That's level three. That's pretty good. Now, I don't believe, yeah, neither of our doctors, I know, because they only have GP um, status, so they're not going to be able to do that. I'll get you. You are a psychiatrist, so you can go in there. There we go. Let's unpause. Let's get another bench as well, just out here. All right, so now we can have someone go into the, uh, hey, we got $50,000 from our vending machine thing. Yeah, now we can have someone go into psychiatry to be treated or diagnosed or whatever. Um, now we should get another little thing soon about what we need to do. Oh yeah, I never got around to this mono beast thing. We still, we still have time on that actually, but I don't, I haven't seen any. <laughs> I've done like a lot of moving of stuff, but apparently not enough. Uh, what's our latest trainer doctor? Okay, well I could probably do that. Let's see, can I train in um, GP2? I can. I can get both of them up. Let's do it. So we're gonna have no GPs for a while, but let's just do it. <laughs> let's just do it, because then we'll have some good doctors. So yeah, the trainer doctor is behind my head. I, I know my head blocks some stuff here. Oh, helicopter. But it's just there. Uh, and then, so mono beasts, we have, what? A few days left on. I haven't really seen any. Not really been looking for it, to be honest. Oh, if I hold tab, all that stuff disappears. Hmm, interesting. Uh, you know what? I'm gonna hire another assistant, because we constantly have them on break. <laughs> <laughs> I think another one might help to actually check people in. All right, so both my doctors, or not both, I've got three doctors, but one of my doctors is a psychiatrist. The other two are getting trained up in GP2, so they'll be better at general practice, which would be nice. Um, we we're about to fail the mono beast thing because I didn't really look for them. I think I'm supposed to be moving more stuff around. I mean, it says I have to look in 
A dark place is an under item, so like, I guess maybe under this? Nah, I don't know. What's my GPQ like at the moment? Three and, oh, my psychiatrist went into that one. That's okay. Special report. You cured five out of six patients in the ward. Sweet, that's pretty good. And I didn't kill any mono beasts, whatever. All right, I'm gonna take off the extra nurse. I feel like my other nurses really shouldn't be in this room. Like my ward management nurse has been kicked out. So that's kind of annoying actually. Hang on, let me uh, yeah, nurses. Just just get out of there, please. I'm gonna turn those off. So only that nurse will work in there. Just cause they're better at it, so. Now my psychiatrist is required back in psychiatry cause they probably just said, oh, you should go to psychiatry. Now I'm the only psychiatrist. So it's gonna be a while, but um, you know, these two look like they're nearly done. Yeah, training. There we go. Cool. So I'm actually going to move you into here real quick. And we got another 60 grand, which is very, very nice. The health minister is visiting. We've completing a completed GP uh, level two, which is great. We've got a new task, which is behind my head. 200 research points. Oh, man. All right. So we have to build a research room. Uh, how much is it for another section of this hospital? 45, 40, 25, 35. 30. Well, which is going to be the most convenient is the question. These two here look pretty good. That's pretty close to the front of the hospital. So I kind of want to get these guys. Let's get this one. I mean, I've got 240,000, so we should be pretty good. Let's just get that one for now. Ah, oh, end of year approaching. Let's go. Oh, okay. We only got three. We got Rising Star Employer of the Year and Best Teaching Hospital because we trained like two staff members, I guess. Sweet. Staff promotion. Of course you want to be promoted. There you go. All right, so this will be built in 12 days. The health minister is here as well. Where are they? Here they are. Hmm. I mean, our hospital's pretty, it's pretty good. I think it's quite nice, to be honest. E-Scan 3 is fully upgraded. I'm going to upgrade this heart racer as well, actually. We should probably get that leveled up. I think that seems pretty good. We're just going to get, get that research going. Oh yeah, this is actually quite good. The door is just here, so it's not too far away, which is nice. All right, so let's go rooms. We need a research. Um, how big does this have to be? Four by three. Okay, can we go kind of an awkward? Once again, they, they, they love doing these awkward buildings, don't they? Can I rotate this? Oh yeah, I can. If I do this, we can probably fit a bathroom here and then a three by three here. And then we have like a thin hallway. Not ideal, but it'll work. I'm only gonna hire one researcher because it's expensive. <laughs> so I'll get the door over this side just so we can fit a bathroom over there. And I'll get some heating, snacky and drinky and a little chair as well. That'll lose. Only level two, but whatever. All right, so we're gonna get that. I'm just gonna pause. I need to hire, is it? It's doctor with research, right? Oh, okay. We're gonna hire you and train you in research because I'm not spending 30 grand for a researcher. So you here, and then we're gonna train you in research and just you. All right, so they'll go to research. That's good. Uh, well done, successfully completed the request. 90 days out of death. Dang, we definitely wouldn't get that in our other hospital. Uh, press the VIP, sweet. So we now, our reputation is high enough. Our staff morale, morale? I don't know why I said morale. Morale is high enough as well. And we're just gonna level up the hospital, which we can do with just building more stuff anyway. So let's go room over here. I'm gonna need a bathroom over this side too. I'll probably just get a blueprint that we have because it probably fit fine. Oh, actually it's kind of a bit awkward, isn't it? Because I, I need it. Okay, let's just build a new one. We get three cubicles in here. I can go one, two, three sinks. Dang, I'm actually surprised that fits. I didn't think that would. I can get a hand dryer there and sanitizer. Yeah. Oh wait, I don't think that fits because it's got the little dollar sign over here. No, oh, okay. You know what? I don't think we can fit this. I'll put, can I put it outside the room? I can. Oh no, it blocks the door. All right, what about there? There you go. Let's just do that. Okay, so we've got a bathroom over there, even though no one's actually working over here yet because my research doctor's not even trained yet. <laughs> a lot of uh, patients are queuing outside rooms that need nurses. Really? Which rooms? Oh, the ward? Yeah. All right. Maybe I should hire... Is there another nurse that we could get? Not one that has ward management, which would be useful. None of these beds are taken. I think that... Was the nurse just not in... Oh, the nurse is just not in the room. They're on a break. Yeah, we should definitely have someone else that can fill in. Uh, lab required. Hang on, what's this? What do we need? Resolution lab. You need to research. Yeah, okay. Well, they're gonna have to go home. I was like, I don't know what that is. It's like, yeah, because we don't have it. Send patient home, send patient home. All right, well, I might need two doctors that can research then, potentially. Anyway, that'll be done in a minute. So I guess the resolution lab is gonna do the eight bitten. We're gonna cure them, is the idea. Hey, why is my staff morale so low? Oh man, my money's getting low. I need to get this research done and quick. <laughs> resolution lab, let's go. Start project. Oh, actually, and let me just make sure that my doctor with research will only do research and nothing else. Cure 10 patients. I'll accept that challenge, why not? Will it give me money? I didn't actually check, probably not. Fracture emergency. I don't have a fracture ward. Cure eight patients. Ooh. You know what? Let me just, let me just 
Let me just pause. We could probably do this. We could probably do this. It's gonna be expensive. Actually might be, a, actually might be a really big risk to try and do this. All right, so we've got this space here. Uh, I was gonna do a three by three room here maybe. Maybe I won't. Maybe this will just become the fracture ward like this. So how big are these things? I need to, I need to see the size again. We got this guy here. That's fine. So we need a cure eight patients. All right. Well, that's going to be one, two. This is not going to be big enough, is it? Another three beds. Oh, do these have to go on the wall? Oh, all right. Hang on. What if we do? Hmm. Oh, come on. Does that really not fit in that spot? Come on. What is this? Oh, I can get it up there. That's fine. But still. All right. So we get all those guys in there. Then I need the little plaster cast. So which I think we need at least a couple, at least a couple, probably more than that. And each of these require a nurse to tend to them. Can I fit more than two of these in here? Probably, but it's going to be a little, little awkward. Like I could do that, get three of them in. And then once we get past this, I might, you know, reduce the size of this a little bit. Level three. Okay, this room is $44,000. All right, nurses. No one. Oh, actually, you do have ward management. So you, Amelia Bilge. Oh, this is Duckworth upon Bilge, isn't it? This hospital. You are made to be here. You are only going to work in wards as well. And actually, I'm just going to spe even specify more. They're only going to work in the fracture ward. And actually, I'm going to turn off Sophia's ability to work in there because I need her in the other one. I need you in this one. So she'll definitely work in here. And then I'm going to hire a couple more nurses. Treatment, bedside manor, injection farm. I mean, these nurses are not ideal. Pharmacy management. I mean, it should be useful for like later on, but not ideal. Um, 30, man, I don't need someone that can do training. All right, well, for now, let's go like this and say extra tough like that. We also need to go items. We need heating because this place is going to be freezing. Can this fit in here? Like, I don't even know where this could go. Oh, that's actually pretty good. There we go. All right, cool. And then we'll get this one here. That'll heat up that space. Then we also need a bench, a bench, snacks. Uh, it's kind of cramped through here. <laughs> uh, sure, drinks machine there, whatever. And then, oh, and then I guess I'll get like a little a bit of fishing clo- no. Hat stand, it's a bit of fun. Coin drop. I guess probably a bin would be useful here too. Or all the trash. So I'll just put that there. Cool. So I'll go there. That should be fine. Let's uh, go there. So hopefully you two will... Ho hopefully you guys... I guess actually they won't get assigned until someone needs to go there maybe. Yeah, there we go. Now they're both going there. Great. So now I need another... Oh my gosh, what is this nurse? Why are you so talented? I don't have money. I've got $58,000. I guess you'll be actually pretty amazing here. So I might get you in there. Tony Biscotti. Oh, yum. <laughs> You get in there. All right, so we've got three nurses working in there. Actually, a lot. So hopefully we can get through those. Probably not worth the, what the 10,000 that I may get from it, considering how much money I spent on it, but whatever. Oh, you're so sad. I'm sorry, man. What's up? Unhappy with pay. Oh, I didn't even realize you worked for me. Pay review. Wait, how come there's only two nurses are showing up here? What is this? Wait, where did you go? Oh, wait, you're a doctor. Wait. What? Dave Aubergine. Who are you? I'm not a nurse. Oh, no, nurses is orange. Wait, why is that orange? I mean, assistant. Oh, okay. I think it's just a bug. <laughs> okay, it's an assistant. Right, right, right. Okay. Well, let's go satisfy pay request. There you go. And here as well. And everyone's happy. All right, so that should be fine, right? You should be okay. I mean, he's got nothing to do because that guy's already working there, but whatever. All right, uh, new illness discovered. We go to the fracture ward. Um, you would like some training. I guess we could do that. So should we do psychiatry too? Or maybe just treatment? I'm going to just do treatment on that. All right, so we got 100 out of 200 research points, which is good. We've got all of my fracture ward patients currently in there, which is amazing. Legitimately surprised by this. And it may actually... We've got all three of these people queuing up to go out. And then there's going to be another one here waiting. Yep. So we've got a little queue. Our money is getting low. You are correct. But hopefully we'll get those research points in a second. And maybe if we complete this fracture ward thing, because all these people should finish up at like the same time. We've cured... My head is in the way. I'm sorry. It's always in the way there. But then if I put it here, block all that stuff. We've killed three already and failed none. Fi oh, I mean, this is going really well. This is going really well. Oh, we failed one. But we've cured five. Pretty incredible. Hey, we've done our research points. We've got 60 grand, thankfully. We are not broke. Oh, see, now my head's covering the money. And we've just cured all those patients as well, which is amazing. Let me put my head back up. <laughs> oh, it's all gone. Okay, so let's go through all these little things. All right, injection room required. Okay, I can get them to wait. I can build that. Staff training required. Not now. Staff promotion. Sure, whatever. Uh, well done. We successfully completed our request from the janitor, which is cure 10 pages. I don't know. Why do the janitor want to do that? I don't know. Oh, maybe just so they don't have to deal with ghosts. <laughs> 
And we got seven out of eight patients. So we got 10 grand from that as well, which is pretty awesome. So I'm also now going to reduce the number of nurses we have in here because I don't think we need, I don't even think we need more than one really. We'll probably be fine with one unless we get a huge influx again. So we'll just turn that down. We don't need three of these if we only have one nurse either because they'll never use all three of them, but we'll just keep them in there. All right, so that's that. So now we have a few extra nurses too, which is good. Oh, injection room. That's what I needed to do. Rooms, injection room. Can we get this in the main hospital? We probably could. Yeah, right here. Three by three, perfect. We get our big injection table. Some medicine cap. Wait, is this, what is this for? Diagnosis and treatment. Probably just want treatment, don't we? I don't think there is just a, no, no it's diagnosis. Is there something that just does treatment? Filter, can I filter by like, oh, it doesn't, doesn't have like a filter for um, treatment power. Ooh, that increases training speed. Interesting. Ooh, there's a nice comfy wicker chair so we don't have to use a wooden chair anymore. I've got enough kudosh. Let me get that. Not necessarily for this room, but I mean, I'll put it in here anyway. That's nice. There's no uh, treatment bonuses, but whatever. That's fine. That's like the, <laughs> it's like the saddest looking room I've seen. All right, so we've got the treatment room now. Oh, the treatment, the injection room, sorry. Nearly level eight as well, actually. We nearly got a one-star hospital. Oh no, we've got to do the eight bit and that's right. We're still researching that. So my, uh... oh, here we go. New targets. Restock eight vending machine. Oh, okay. Well, I can do that. Uh oh, we have another epidemic warning. Let's go. Four infected people. What is this one? Oh, it's the same one as before. All right. So, oh, oh, I see you. And you. This is how you stop an epidemic in its tracks. Anyone else that is walking like that? Sometimes they don't show the symptoms until it's too late. Okay, well, we got two. Oh my gosh. <gasps> you. Eight bitten. <laughs> they had it as well. All right. Who else? One more before it gets out of hand here. Oh. You. Hey, got him. Cool. All right, now where was I? I was restocking vending machines. <laughs> restocking, restocking. I think I was already doing that one. Okay, we're up to three of eight. That's good. Cause that'll give us a nice little bit of cash bonus, which we definitely, need. what are you doing? You're doing nothing. Look at this fracture ward as well, by the way. It's huge and there's nothing going on there. <laughs> Training required. Staff training. You got ward management and an injection. I can train you. Should we do ward management too, Sophia? Probably be good actually, because you are my ward nurse, so let's do it. Hopefully we don't need you in there right now. Actually, we might. Hang on. I should probably uh, just quickly allow... Oh, you Biscotti can work in there, that's fine. I was gonna say, I should allow some other nurses to work in these wards as well. Uh, sure. And you as well can work in both wards. Okay, yeah, there's someone to fill in, that's that's fine. How's actually this research going, by the way? We are, what, 355 out of a thousand. I guess we... Is there another doctor? Either a student doctor? Oh, there is, okay. I was say, maybe we should hire a couple student doctors and we can get them done in research and then, um... So I would like to keep these guys available to research... Of research, <laughs> to hire. All right, this place is looking pretty good. We still... Oh my God, you were sitting in a... <laughs> okay. <laughs> I was like, this place is looking pretty good. Meanwhile, you're sitting in a pile of yellow liquid. I don't know what it was, but probably not good. Resolution lab required. No, don't get him to wait. Ah, oh, I think I just clicked wait. I need to send him home. Is my... Who is waiting? Is it you? With the question mark? No, why would... No. Hmm. Is it you with the question mark? I don't know. Someone's what is it you? Are you waiting for it? Send, get out of here. Go home. <laughs> There's nothing I can do about it. Send you home as well. But we're, we're working on it. We're working on it. Okay. Staff promotion. There you go. Training is done. Okay. So now I can hire another doctor and train you in research. Oh, I don't have money. I need to restock a couple of vending machines. Oh boy. We're low on cash. Can I, um, yeah, I can use you to train him. Okay. Okay. Free. I just have to use my current research doctor to train the new research doctor. All right. We got the 50 grand. Woo. Well, that was close. All right, we need to, we gotta keep up with these little tasks to get that money, otherwise we're gonna struggle pretty bad. Give me another task, I need the, I need the money. Okay, here we go, what is it? Generate 200 research points. Oh no, I'm busy, I don't, I can't. Hang on, I need to, before I lose all this money, I need to get a second research desk in here so we can get the second person in here too. Uh, okay, I'm gonna put that there for now. Move this over here. Okay, so that, that has enough room for both of them. Once the training is done. Oops, that's not the training room. The training is done. Hopefully, I like how the, you're teaching them how to research. It's like, I, don't, I don't know how that works, but sure. Uh, so that's going. Apparently we've generated two research points. I'm not even sure how that's happened, but I'm not going to complain about it. <laughs> right, we got 20 grand and we're going to be dropping pretty quick. Hey, oh no, we don't make money from retail, do we? I was going to say, we don't even make money from vending machines. It's kind of crazy. That doesn't make any sense. Like even if it is a public hospital, wouldn't you still make money from like vending machines? Or unless I guess it goes back to the government or whatever. Hey, I guess. Oh boy. Here we go. <laughs> oh dear. All right, negative 5,000. All right, not too bad. Ward emergency. Ooh, I can get 10 grand if I can do the jazz hands. Let me say yes, ward emergency. And get an extra nurse in there. Maybe three. Let's get three in there. I actually don't know if we have room for three because it's not assigning another one. So let's just do two. Staff challenge. Possible attraction. No, I don't want to do that. Uh, press a VIP. Okay. Um, wait, what? How did I get 200 research points? I don't know, but I got 50 grand. So wait. 
For my, was it just because of it? Wait. Oh, maybe I got it from that task that I clearly didn't read. I don't know what it was, but... It's fine. We got it. We got it. <laughs> Someone in, there's no one in here researching, is there? No, there's no one in here. I, I don't know. All right. Train a staff member. Oh, does this... Please tell me this counts. Please tell me this counts because I just did it. Yes, that does count. 114 grand. Sweet. That was easy. Suckers. All right, now I'm going to make sure that that new staff member with research is only researching because I don't want to do anything else. Cool. So now we should have two researchers working in here. Perfect. And hopefully we can get that um, resolution lab done. Water 10 plants. Oh, man. All right. Uh, is this water? Yes. Let's go water that one. I didn't even place these, but I'm glad we have them. We go around and water all these guys. Whoa, that person just got shocked. Is that all of them? I might need to buy some more. Oh, she's one here. I might need to buy more plants to water them all. All right. Training for you. You know what? I will train you. I'm going to train you in ward management too. I'm even going to pay for it. I'm going to pay someone to come and train you. That's how, how much I care about you. Oh, actually, maybe I should not. I don't have that much money. <laughs> I also have huge queues with the GPs right now. Actually, do we have... I don't think I've changed the settings here, have I? How do I do it again? Uh, uh, where do I go again? Oh, here. Overview. This is what I want. Uh, fast track treatment. Yes. Diagnosis threshold. That's fine. Soft training messages. Uh, no, you stay in the room when you're idle. And let's maybe drag that down to 85% treatment. All right. So that should hopefully cut down on some of the GP visits. Hey, I cured six out of six patients. Look at that. Apparently I got 20 grand for it too. That's awesome. Got to water three more plants. Are we still in the queue for watering or have we already done the... Oh yeah, no, they're doing that one. Oh no, that was just a nurse. Can you overwater plants? Oh, someone died. I thought we were doing really well. We haven't really had many deaths, to be honest. It's been pretty good. Look at this fracture ward. What a waste. <laughs> Maybe I should downsize this a bit. Yeah, let me let me edit this. Uh, let's sell that. Sell that. I'd sell like probably four of these. Okay, <laughs> it's probably fine. I don't think it needs to be any bigger than that. How's that research going? 840, very nice. All right, I need to promote someone. I'm going to... Wait, what is this? Uh, we need pest control. Um, I guess I can get you to wait. For oh my gosh, there's so many people in there. All right, pest control. And this is... How big is it? Four by four. Four by five would fit really nicely here. So I guess that's what we're going to do. So that'll go here and we can get the ultrasonic cannon. I don't know which way they get into this thing. I'm going to do it this way then. That'll go there. Get a fire extinguisher, of course. Oh, where's that new chair I got? Didn't I get that sweet wicker chair? Ah, oh, yeah. Wicker chair. All right, that'll do. So who does this need? A nurse. I think we have enough nurses, so it should be all right. Items, let's get a bench out over here. Get a couple. Snack machine. Oh, I didn't even place it. Snack machine. Drinks machine. Get a bin. Heating. And a little, little leaflet stand. There you go. Look at that. Beautiful. All right, promote you and resolution lab. You're going to have to go home. Actually, we're nearly done with it. You probably could have waited. Got to water one more plant. How have we not done that? Go water this one, please. <laughs> what is going on in here? What are all these puddles? I think we need another janitor. <laughs> Head office required. Oh, boy. All right. Get patient to wait. Uh... And I'll promote you. Oops, that's not the button I wanted. All right, we need head office. Here we go. This is also a four by four, which I wonder, oh, it won't fit there, will it? If I put the door there, that would have made more sense. Hang on. Sorry, guys, I got to edit this room whilst you're in it, which is never a good idea because it'll get you annoyed, but that's fine. It's fine. All right, so head office, we go here, four by four. All right, there we go. So who does this need? This needs a doctor. Hmm, maybe I should hire a doctor. Do they need? I don't think they need anything for it. Uh, so maybe we should just hire one more. Get yeah, a student doctor. Oh, get in there. <laughs> That'll do. I should probably have a staff room or something over here as well, because the other one's quite far away. But let's just see how we go. Right, so we completed watering of the plants, which is beautiful. I need surgery as well. <laughs> it looks so funny. But you can just see my eyes above the edge of this. Um, okay. Uh, I'm going to have to wait. Uh, we can probably get surgery here. Can I make a blueprint for surgery? I feel like I should have. No. All right, so this goes here. Door there. Now, I tried multiple curtains, didn't I? And it didn't seem to work. They seemed to only still use one. But I'm going to get two curtains anyway. Like two changing curtain screen things. Even though they only seem to use one. Get a wall monitor here. The operation monitor over here. Some medicine cabinet as well, because that will help. Some hand sanitizer is probably a good idea. I need no heating as well for it. <laughs> Surgery room. How about a coffee machine? You can just hang out in here. <laughs> it's a pretty chill environment. Oh, there's not actually anywhere to put it. I move, if I move the radiator, I might be able to <laughs> get a sweet dispenser. There we go. Water cooler, sweet dispenser. And then we just need a little chair just to chill out as well. There you go. Just <laughs> hang out over here on a wicker chair. Hmm. Maybe maybe not a wicker chair. Maybe just a wooden chair. <laughs> Beautiful. All right, so I could save this. It's prestige level three. Level three surgery. There we go. Now, um... I need a doctor. Oh, they're expensive. Where's that student? Oh no, I don't have enough money to train. 
Hang on, I gotta see what the next thing is. Here we go. Water ten- Water ten plants again! Come on! Alright, two- I mean, it's pretty sweet deal. <laughs> Why would they give me 50 grand for this? Three, four, five, seven. That person's really cold there, apparently. Also, this whole bathroom apparently needs a bunch of maintenance. I also have no money. <laughs> just- just great, isn't it? Hey, award season! Let's go! Uh, so we've got Rising Star, Employer of the Year, Best Teaching Hospital, and Best Research Hospital. There you go. Actually, speaking of research, yeah, we're done. Sweet. So now let's research... How about just money? Yeah, I'll put 20,000. Oh, wait, I can't even... I need a thousand dollars to start it. <laughs> okay. Well, we'll have to wait till we get all the plants watered. Can I water this again? Yes, and this one. Public... Level... Get a level four surgery. Oh, I got more than one target. Okay, well, I could get a level four surgery if I had some cash. Good way for one more plant to be watered. Hey, there it is. Okay. So now I can do a level four surgery quite easily. All you gotta do is grab some of the gold star awards and just show everyone how good we are by putting them up on the walls. I'll save it. Level four surgery. Cool. All right. Do we have a new doctor that is... Oh, we got a student doctor. I'm gonna grab you. So my... What is going on in these bathrooms? Why are all of those broken? <laughs> I'm gonna grab you. I'm gonna train you in surgery. We've got two student doctors. Maybe two surgeons would be good. Get on that. Man, this place... What? Do I not have enough janitors or is it just because they're watering plants 24-7? Is that the problem? <laughs> is it because they're doing too much crap all over the place? Get another janitor. Like, what is happening in here? These need to be repaired, like, now. In a level 4 GP's office. All right. Actually, should be pretty easy as well. Oh, wait. I, I need to edit it so I can see the little bar. This is just the doctors showing off how good they are. They're like, look how many awards I got. <laughs> all right. Now we got $169,000. Pretty epic, actually. I think we definitely need another GP's office. What is going on in this hallway? We've got green and yellow puddles of mysterious liquids. I don't want to know what they are. What is this? Why is there trash everywhere? Public targets, hospital attractiveness. All right. I think if we filter, hang on. There's a lot of people dying right now too. Filter by decorative. Here we go. Some trophy cases around maybe. Why, why are there so many ding-dongs of people dying? DNA emergency. I don't have a DNA lab, so no. Uh, <laughs> Resolution lab. Oh, actually, yes, I can. I can do that now. Press the VIP with a nice hospital. Well, pretty rough at the moment. All right, so now we can build the resolution lab. It's a four by four. Oh, that doesn't fit here. Oh, I'm gonna need another building. So I'm gonna have to buy this and build it there. All right, so the janitors do seem to be struggling still. I'm wondering, maybe I should get you. You can get some maintenance skill on you. Get this place cleaned up at least. Staff challenge. Get a level four head office. Why? Why do they want all these level four places? Is this my head office? What is this? That's no, pest control. This is head office. There we go. That also upped our attractiveness a little bit too, which is our public target. So let's go items. Maybe if we get some... I don't want plants because... Oh God, no wonder it's so bad in this place. Costume chest, a cha maybe a charity dog. Maybe that'll help us. Get a little thing like that and we'll get charity dog. There, there you go, look how good that is. <laughs> Ew. I definitely don't have enough um, janitors in this place. Jukebox? No. I need more stuff that's just decorative. Oh, look at all these different vending machines we can get. I didn't even realize there's so many different ones. Got a hat stand, that'll help. There you go, hat stand. Yeah, I just need the janitors to clean up a little bit. Like just, just a little. And then this place will be a lot nicer. All right, what is this? Uh, we need a shock clinic, okay? And we need eight bitten. Yeah, they can wait as well because I am building that. And I love all head office, which I think I already did. Okay, so we're waiting for that to be, be built. How, much, how big is a shock clinic? Shock clinic. Uh, well, four by four. Okay, well, it's gonna have to go over here as well. All right, here we go. So rooms, we need eight bitten. Oh, sorry, resolution lab. That's <laughs> eight bitten's the disease. So four by four, leave room there for like a bathroom mode. Oh, yeah, look at this thing. Sweet. And then we'll get, what is this? What does the server do again? Reset. Okay, well, I don't want that then. Oh, the debugger. Very nice. <laughs> right. Heating. Also very important. Extinguisher in case there's a fire. Gonna get some snacks, obviously, and somewhere to sit. All right, so that's gonna be my resolution lab. And then I need the shock clinic too. All right, so those are those are both good. So we need, who do we need for this? A doctor and a doctor. All right, maybe we should get a couple more doctors. Oh, why are you guys so good and so expensive? Hang on, let's see if we can get someone else. That's not as good. You actually might be useful with the psychiatry and the GP, so I might get you. Ah, here we go. Cream of the crop. Agnes Credible. <laughs> Are you going there? All right, so that's good. Let's get some benches here. Bench, bench, and bench. And what's our new task? We just got a new one. Hospital attractiveness. Oh, it's gone down again. Oh, yeah, we got some bugs and stuff running around the place. Oh, epidemic warning. Four infected people. Let's go. Is it the same one? It is. Okay, let's let it run a little bit and pour... Uh, Pause. Okay. Hello. Oh man, there's so many more people now than there used to be. Oh boy. <gasps> yes. Found one of them. You. Uh, okay, that's. I found one. Literally one of one person. Okay, slow down time. Slow down time. Anyone? Oh, you. <laughs> you sneaky little one. There we go. 
Okay, no one there that I can see. Oh, you're dying anyway, but I'll vaccinate you. <laughs> they were about to die anyway because the symbol above the head, but you know. Okay, no one over there. There's one more, but where? So you, you're doing magic. Why do we actually have a wizard in here? We actually do have a wizard in this one. <gasps> There you are. Hey, got him. Oh, great. So hospital attractiveness is once again, very low. <laughs> uh, attractiveness. Is, there, is it because it's dirty? It's actually not too dirty. It's just we don't actually have that many decorative things now. Staff training, not now. Oh, actually, you know what? Yes, I do need to train someone. Never mind. Let's go GP3. I get both my GPs in here. <laughs> just take them out of those queues. We got 14 and 15 people waiting. Let's just get them, get them trained. All right, items. I need some nice decorative stuff. Maybe some more hat stands around the place is what we need. Like over here could use a hat stand, you know? And over here could also use a hat stand. Where else could use a hat stand? Ah, in the uh, fracture ward, of course. Oh, invalid. Come on. Get another one over here. Hey, there we go. <laughs> <laughs> Let's get my money up. All right, so we're gonna train a staff member, which we're currently training two. We're gonna have a huge queue for GPs, or just not very good GPs for a while. Oh, I'm totally missing the um the eight bit machine. Oh, look, you're normal again. I wanna I wanna watch this properly this time because I missed it. Is this person who is this? Are you even good at your job, student doctor? <laughs> okay, he's learning on the job. Desperate for toilet. Yeah, these ones are broken for a while, and then they're not very good. All right, let's let's watch this. Hang on. <laughs> no, that's awesome. I don't think it worked though, did it? Wait, let's see. I mean, he looks good. Oh yeah, it did work. Sweet. Two out of five. We're on our way. Oh, speaking of on our way, we can actually do more research now. I'm going to research a resolution lab instead of money because I think if we can upgrade that machine, it'll be better. Seems to have a lot of ghost issues in here too, by the way. Let's get another janitor that can uh, take care of ghosts. I know that one just did it, but I think we need another janitor in general. This place is just so messy. All right, so we need to train a staff member and promote a staff member, which we should probably promote something right now. There you go. Easy. 50 grand. Beautiful. <laughs> Some of these are pretty good. Like, I like the ones that are kind of easy. So these guys are both my GPs. They're both going to be really good at being a GP. Uh, and we also need to promote another staff member again, which we should get another thing pop up soon anyway. So I'll just let that do its thing. Like, after these guys are trained, they're probably going to want a promotion. So, all right. So train a staff member done. And they're probably going to want a promotion now. I also need to probably go to staff and go to my job list. Because these guys really need to be the GPs because that's what they're good at. And the other GPs, I'm going to sort of deselect like the surgeon probably shouldn't be in there or the student doctor. I'll leave you available to do it because you do have one GP, but you should mostly be doing psychiatry to be honest. So I'm going to take these doctors out. So hopefully both my actual good GPs go in. Let's see. So we've got, hang on. Yep. Three GP and three. Yeah. So that should be good. So it's plus 15% diagnosis on each of those levels. which is pretty nice. And we currently need a research. Oh, uh, we'll generate 200 research points again for some more money. And we should get a promotion of staff thing pop up, right? Or can I just promote you now? Pay review. There's not really like a button to promote though. That's just pay review. Underpaid. Well, you haven't asked for more money. That's not my fault. The janitor. Well, ask for money then. Don't be like, oh, I'm not getting paid enough. Well, when you say you're not getting paid enough. I mean, they, they probably did, but I mean, didn't see it, so. Eight bit emergency, cure seven patients. You know what? I'll try. Who's my best doctor? Because we should probably get them in there. <laughs> Uh, oh, I don't really have a, a overall just like good doctor. I mean, I guess you because you got a bit of treatment. Belinda, here you are. You, I'm going to put you just near here. But yeah, you go in there. I don't think I'm going to get all these patients cured, but my plan is that it should be enough to get cure five patients with the eight bins so and then we can get a one star hospital, right? So let's see. We got them all waiting here. Actually, I'm pretty sure this hallway is going to be freezing cold as well. Let's get some vending machines here as well, real quick. Snack machine. There you go. All right. And then I've also got promotion, which we can do that. And I'll complete that public target. And then new illness, heart throb. We'll go to surgery. That's fine. And I need to restock eight vending machines again. All right. So I'll just go through and just click a bunch of these, get a bunch of free money. Oh, here's the money beast. I finally found them. Yeah. Oh, I'm clicking on all this other stuff. All right. Well, I got a few of them. Anyway, uh, back to restocking. <laughs> oh, what's this? Chromotherapy. Uh, I'm gonna go get you to go home right now. I don't want to do that. I'm kind of busy right now. So we've cured three out of five. That's pretty good. Hey, four out of five. So now, if that person stands up and we just did our vending machines, we needed a level four fluid analysis department, which we don't even have. Oh, there's a janitor having to repair the machine. Okay. <laughs> no, 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 don't. Belinda, no. Oh, no. We got the student doctor coming in to fill in. <laughs> Shoot five monobies. Well, there was a bunch. Oh, there's one. I was say, there was a bunch of them under that vending machine. Maybe I know this. Oh, yeah, here we go. <laughs> oh, come on. What is selecting other items? That's not my fault. It won't let me click on them. That's so not fair. It's like clicking other stuff. Stop clicking other patients. <laughs> no, move. Get out of the way. Oh. Hey, one star hospital. 
Whoa, I unlocked a bunch of stuff. Okay, so we unlocked like 50 different hospitals. I'm required to inform you that Two Point Health Ministry is awarded your hospital a one star rating. Quit whilst you're ahead. Okay, so we, well, I'm gonna go back to the map and check it out. Grockle Bay? Okay. Mm, exotic diseases. All right, there's gonna be like 50 of these, so I'm gonna just like... <laughs> well, I just unlocked so many hospitals, so let's just skip that. Hey, got another thing. Pemberley Reef. Oh, so I think that was one of the DLCs, right? And I got this one, which is... Uh, Farm of the Green Things. Yeah, I think these are all like the DLC stuff, right? But yeah, we got a whole bunch more we can do now. So we've got a hospital, not that one. So down over here, we got this guy unlocked. We got this one unlocked. That one we'll have to complete first. We got another one down over here. Got one over here as well. There's a few of them. On oh, and these ones over here as well. That guy, the one up here. There's, there's a whole bunch. I don't even know which hospital we should do next. So let me know in the comments down below which hospital we should go to next. Uh, there's, I think, I guess any of the DLCs or... I don't know, if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments down below. But thank you so much for watching. I will see you next time and have an awesome day.